A federal appeals court has ruled former President Donald Trump is not immune from prosecution on the basis of presidential immunity. It's been part of Trump's defense, arguing he can't be charged for actions related to January 6th because he was still president at the time, an argument a three-judge panel has rejected. The U.S. Court of Appeals for the D.C. Circuit said in their ruling, for the purpose of this criminal case, former President Trump has become citizen Trump with all of the defenses of any other criminal defendant. But any executive immunity that may have protected him while he served as president no longer protects him against this prosecution. This involves Trump's 2020 federal election case, where special counsel Jack Smith is hoping to begin trial in March. But Trump has suggested before he would immediately appeal if the ruling was not in his favor, likely leaving it to the Supreme Court and potentially delaying the trial. Ahead of today's ruling, Trump posted on Truth Social, quote, If immunity is not granted to a president, every president that leaves office will be immediately indicted by the opposing party. Without complete immunity, a president of the United States would not be able to properly function. A key issue here for the prosecution and Trump's team is timing, given it's an election year and Trump is the leading Republican candidate. Special counsel Jack Smith has asked the courts to move quickly to keep the trial on schedule. The entire case has been on pause while this immunity battle plays out. The high court does have the option to fast track the case.